Hi, my name is Elise, and I'm going to explain some of the concepts and framework that you use to program the now with Python. This is called the now key framework. So you've probably done the hello world and played around a little bit with your robot. Let's get into some of the reasons why the hello world works. We'll talk about methods, modules, brokers, and proxies. So methods are just actions that modules can do. For example, you could have a dog module with methods like speak, sit, and fetch. The parentheses allow you to pass parameters in. So, for example, you might want your dog to fetch a stick instead of a ball. In terms of the robot, we've already seen some of its modules. For instance, AL text to speech and AL robot posture. They have methods like, say, set parameter, go to posture, and say. But the modules and their methods are way out here on the robot, and you are programming on your computer. How do you get access to those modules? The key is called the broker. The broker is a program running on the robot that acts like a librarian. It knows all about those modules and the methods that it owns, including these two, and when you ask it to, it makes them available to you for you to use. It can't just give you a module straight up, though, so instead it gives you a proxy to that module. So to switch metaphors, a proxy is a little bit like a voodoo doll of the module. The module is here on your robot, and you've got a voodoo doll proxy of the module here on your computer, and anything you do to it or tell it to do, it does on the robot. So when you go to your TTS proxy and tell it to say hello world, the text-to-speech module on the robot makes the robot say hello world. So that's what you're doing up here when you say TTS equals AL proxy. You're asking the broker at this IP address in this port, the broker on that robot, to give you a proxy of this module, AL text-to-speech. And then you store that voodoo doll proxy in this variable TTS, and you can do whatever you want with it. So here's a little bit more of a technical layout of what we're talking about. We've got a broker on the robot with access to all of its modules and all their methods, and it gives you proxies on your computer so that you can use those modules long distance. There isn't just a broker on your robot, though. You can actually write your own brokers for your own modules. In fact, if you want to make modules for the robot to react to events and stimulation, like recognizing a word or a face, then you'll have to make your own broker. It's not hard. We'll talk about it in the next module. Thanks.